Kayla Koala and Her Mama by Harley Tai. Illustrated by Chuling Muva. Narrated by Amy Weaver. In the Australian bush, two koalas reside. Kayla Koala and her mama live side by side. At the rising of the sun and the blooming of the moon, Mama promises, Darling, I will always be with you. They have a sweet bond, always snuggling close. Playing hide and seek is what they enjoy most. But one day while playing, Kayla sneaks a peek, worrying Mama will be gone when it's time to seek. Mama smiles at her innocence and hugs her tight. Her honesty and purity are shining bright. Kayla hops on Mama's back as she happily walks, listening to the sounds as nature talks. Why do dingoes hunt and howl at night? asks Kayla Koala who feels quite a fright. Some animals shout, that's just what they do. But don't worry, darling, I will always be with you. Kayla's smile grows under the sky's bright hue. I love you so much, Mama. I will always cherish you. They continue along, happy and at peace. Feelings they believe never will cease. Life is good and life is bliss. But sudden hot windy air makes them feel amiss. Like a whirlwind it comes, bushfires start blazes. Kayla's in a tree, shaken scared as she gazes. Mama has never seen fires this vicious in the past. Quickly, she moves to protect Kayla as the fire spreads fast. Panic everywhere, animals trample the ground. Screaming and crackling wood is the only sound. A blazing red fire draws near. Smouldering ash floats through the air. Mama acts quickly as heat covers the tree. Bringing Kayla down, then they both attempt to flee. Joining the herd of animals, making movements frantic, stumbling and tumbling, all in a panic. Kangaroos, wombats, possums and more are all trying to escape the fire's roar. Smoke engulfs the air, and Kayla can hardly breathe. Smog and ashes are all she can see. The sky is painted black, it no longer looks blue. Kayla grips Mama tight, and she carries her baby through. Mama breathes heavily, past her limit she goes. The strong love for her daughter shows. Burnt and injured, scorched on her feet, but Mama just keeps going through the blazing heat. Around them is no one, the other animals all gone. Just Mama and Kayla keep pressing on. Kayla's heart breaks, seeing Mama in pain. She tells Mama, let me walk to ease your strain. But Mama's love shines bright, still holding a smile. Darling, I will always be with you, she bravely tells her child. Without food, she pushes forward in survival mode. Day after day, but her determination isn't slow. Mama grows weaker as her strength depletes, aching from her head to her feet. But a sudden glimmer of hope overloads. A house in the distance 
as they arrive at a road. Mama is having an energy loss, wobbling as she finds an interval to cross, paying close attention to avoid being hit, arriving at the porch, placing Kayla there to sit. The residents see Mama and Kayla lying flat. Poor things must be hungry and thirsty, they chat. Mama gasps for breath before closing her eyes. Please don't leave me, my Mama Koala, Kayla cries. The residents rush to Mama and Kayla's aid, taking them to the animal hospital where they are laid. Mama keeps wheezing, getting worse and worse. The doctors hop into action along with the nurses. Kayla refuses to leave her mama alone, holding tight, remaining within mama's zone. Needles inject medicine into mama's veins to help heal her wounds and soothe the pains. Time goes by, but mama is still hurt and weak, so much that she cannot even speak. Kayla watches as humans try to make her okay, giving more medicine and care to her day by day. But Mama stays still, unable to move, not yet with the strength to get back in her groove. By her side, Kayla quietly stays. Please come back to me, Mama, she earnestly prays. Then one day, Mama's eyes open wide. Darling, I will always be with you and be at your side. Kayla sinks into her fur, happy to be alive, thankful to the people who helped save their lives. Both lay beside each other, bed to bed, recovering energy and finding peace in their heads. Traumatised but grateful for another chance at life, having overcome such a hard time. Mama's burns are nursed with great care here. She gets healed with Kayla, snuggling close at her rear. They stay at the rehab centre where they see familiar faces that saved koalas, keeping them in good graces. Mama soon recovers and is now just as before, able to once again lift Kayla from the floor. Joy fills the air with their voices and fun, mother and daughter reunited as one. One day Mama says, my darling we're getting there to rebuild our life in greater care. They smile happy to no longer be exiled, as they are taken to a new home in the wild. A new place of belonging, one where they aren't alone. The animals welcome them into their new home. Once without a place to stay, now they're in a happy place where they can live and play. As the moon shines down, and its glow spreads light. Kayla is fast asleep, aloft in a tree in the night. Mama stares up at her with a smile so bright and true. Didn't I tell you, my darling, I will always be with you. A heartfelt tale of love between mother and child. Even the rage of fire couldn't defile. In the midst of troubles, their bond held still. Tough times won't last forever, but tough spirits will. Dear children, thank you for watching and listening to 
Kayla Goala and her mama. I hope you like the video book. The ebook and paperback are available from Amazon, eBay, or any bookstore where you live. Or you can go to my bookstore at the link below. Let's put our hands together to save the koalas, wildlife, animals, and our beautiful planet. <laughs>